If you're looking for a vodka cocktail that is easy to make, refreshing and super boozy, keep watching because today I'm going to show you a little bit about the Moscow Mule. Hey guys, so the Moscow Mule, it has been around for a pretty long time. It's around, we're talking 1939, something around there. So a guy by the name of John G. Martin had just recently purchased the rights to Smirnoff Vodka. His friend Jack Morgan had a really famous bar called the Cock and Bull on the Sunset Strip in Hollywood. Now, the boys decided that uh, they weren't selling a lot of ginger beer, they weren't selling a lot of vodka, so they teamed together and decided, uh, why don't we make a cocktail uh, that we can get rid of both of our stock? They decided to combine the ingredients, vodka, ginger beer, add a little bit of fresh lime to it, and bang, there you have the Moscow Mule. The final link was when one of Jack's girlfriends had recently inherited a copper making company and they had a bunch of surplus copper mugs and she said, please guys, you need to serve up this cocktail in a copper mug. And guess what? They started selling out those as well. So the three of them did really, really well out of this. And to top it off a few years later, uh, John Martin got even more creative. He went out and bought one of the latest inventions, which was the Polaroid camera. He went out to bars, got the bartenders to hold the copper mug and a bottle of Smirnoff. He would take one photo, give it to the bartender and keep another one to show to neighboring bars and say, hey guys, check out this. This is like the best cocktail that you can have. Uh, you're missing out on it. What a stroke of genius. It is now, you know, one of the most popular vodka cocktails in summertime at a lot of the venues that I've had over the years. And it's really easy to make. I'm gonna show you that right now, it is just 60 mils of vodka. I'm just using the JJ Whitley vodka. Then 15 mils of freshly squeezed lime juice. Add some ice. And topped off with some ginger beer. I'm going to use the fever tree. I like to give that a little bit of a stir. And just a couple Lime wedges for a garnish. That is it, Moscow Mule. Super, super simple. Got some cool story about it as well. I'm gonna give it a try. It's so refreshing. Uh, two shots of booze in it. Definitely creeps up on you. I like this in winter time as well. The spice from the ginger beer works. So it's an all year, all round drink. For home, for your friends. If you're feeling a bit lazy, don't wanna do too much. How simple is that to make? Uh, guys, like, subscribe. Please, we're trying to get to those thousand subscribers. And we'll see you again soon on Let's Talk Drinks.